everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm doing a neutral monochrome classic work outfits video. This video is sponsored by Express. You guys have been asking for work videos a lot lately. So the first one I did was more casual. This is more like reporting to the office, but still I feel like a really good mix of really beautiful classic work pieces. All right, so first off, we have this really beautiful monochrome blue look. I still consider colors neutrals if the color is a little more muted. So this is a really pretty sleeveless turtleneck top it's super soft it fits really well i'm wearing an extra small by the way be sure to check out the description box before you leave because all the links will be down there and i will also put the sizes to everything that i am wearing in the description box as well what i decided to pair with this top are these pants kind of like an editor pant they fit so well and they're super super comfortable materials really 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 nice i think the nice thing about stuff that i picked um, for this video is that you could wear them to work but you could also wear them separately with things you have in your closet for just casual wear or dress it up dress it down whatever all right so these pants are really nice the length is perfect they hit me right at my ankle um, they also have longer lengths if you want they have pockets and then to just complete the look right here i would wear it with like a coat we're in fall right now so it's getting really cool where you are um so i just throw on a coat you could do a blazer even a puffer and then i just wanted to do off white for the outside i feel like it really makes the blue pop and it just looks really nice together so those are my accessories and this is how i complete the outfit that's outfit number one all right look number two so i have an all nude or beige outfit and this one is more for a laid back workplace or maybe like a casual Friday. I don't know if that's still a thing in different places. Maybe the dynamic has changed after COVID, but I thought this is really, really cute. And I think the pants are still really wearable because they're not like super loud. They are a faux leather, but they're not shiny. They're more of a matte faux leather. So I thought this was a really beautiful look. So starting off, I have this like mock neck long sleeve. And I don't know if you can see this because it kind of blends in with my skin, but there are some cutouts here. They're very subtle, but I think they're still appropriate for the workplace just because they're so, they're not too small, but they're not big by any means. And the placement is, I think it's fine. Otherwise you could just get something similar without any cutouts. And then again, like I said, these pants, they're so cute. And again, like I mentioned in the previous outfit, this is something you could wear to work, but also wear out separately or together it's just a really beautiful beautiful fit and then to complete the look right here i'm just throwing on this wool coat making it a super monochrome outfit i have my purse and my heels obviously if you want to break the colors up and you don't want to go monochrome like this or if this is too much for you you could pair it with like an off-white coat or a blazer what have you i also love like a monochrome look for work just because sometimes it makes it a little more interesting rather than your like white button up with black pants you know what i'm saying so this is kind of why i choose to do these monochrome neutral looks for the workplace i think it's super clean and polished and it's just really nice to look at in my opinion and i'm not sure if i mentioned but everything is new everything is available right now on express okay next outfit i had to get this dress i really loved the silhouette i love like the pleated skirt and it's knitted it's so soft it's so comfortable Comfortable. It looks like it could be a separate like a top and a skirt, but I love that it is actually a dress and I would definitely wear boots with this. I love this whole look. So this is what it looks like up close. Hopefully you can see the pleating and how beautiful that is. So it does have a little bit of like a keyhole back right here. So I am still able to wear a bra. The keyhole starts like above the bra. And if you are uncomfortable with that, if that's something that, you know, you probably can't wear to work, I would just throw on like a black tank top underneath to cover it up. And the tank top won't show obviously because it's just all covered up in the front here. And then if you did want to kind of like spice this up a little, you could even add like a really nice belt. I really love the idea of just doing like a thicker or bigger black belt just like this. I initially tried it on with a belt that had a gold buckle, but for some reason I didn't love it as much. Um, and I just kind of like the all black look. It's very sleek, very elegant. 
Um, and then again with the boots, kind of just edges it up a little bit. And you just look cute for work, you know? All right, next up we have a gray number. This kind of looks blue, but it's definitely gray. It's more of like a slate gray. When I look at the blue outfit I had on earlier, it's definitely gray. Um, but I love this outfit. It's a little bit different because the pants are a low-waisted pant, which I feel like is really coming back. Um, Express has a lot of these low waisted pants, so if these are like your thing or you wanna try it out, these are amazing. So I just paired it with this bodysuit, which don't sleep on Express bodysuits, especially this specific kind. I have probably around three of these types of bodysuits right now. They're like amazing because they have some kind of compression so it just makes everything super smooth and seamless the material is so nice the quality is so good and the structure is great as well so i paired this bodysuit with these pants these are like a boot cut and i just paired them with you know my nude pumps and i was kind of torn between doing nude or doing the off-white i love the look of this obviously you can throw a coat on again i was torn i'll show you the two different like looks that i would use to complete it but I thought it could use something to break it up. You could use like a belt. Um, I thought this necklace kind of broke it up a little bit, but I also loved how it just like flowed seamlessly as a gray outfit. So first look to kind of break it up is using nude or beige on the outside. So here is the outfit with the beige. So beige heels and beige coat. So you guys let me know which one you liked better or if you like the off-white better with the white shoes and the white coat. You could also do a blazer. So here it is with a blazer. I don't think I love it as much. Um, this also could be really cute with like a trench coat over it. Could be a really cute trench number. Otherwise, honestly, I even just love the outfit by itself. So these are the back of the pants. And they do have pockets and they fit really, really nicely and they just sit perfectly on my waist. All right, last work outfit is this V-neck sweater top. It's like a wrap over um, and it has a tie, but there are two ways that I would wear it. Um, so I just took the tie and I just wrapped it around in the back. So I will show you, it's actually tied in the back just like that. So the top is meant to be tied in the front like this. So you could also wear it like this, which is really cute. Um, I just pulled it out and pulled it up a little bit. So it makes it kind of look like a belt. So this is one way you could wear it, but I actually like it just the way I had it in the beginning. So I basically am taking this and wrapping it in the front and pulling it back and then just tying it back with that. So it just kind of looks like a belt and then it just kind of looks like an added bonus. It just kind of makes it a little more like, I don't know, fun and interesting, I guess. And this is just like a scuba brown midi skirt. And I love browns for fall. It's such a big color right now. And I just paired it with some pumps, some new pumps. You can pair it with boots, what have you. I feel like it'd be really cute with like snake print boots. But again, I don't know how appropriate that is. Um, this is kind of what I was talking about. Here's side by side snake print boot versus the heel. So regardless, I think this is just still such a cute little sweater top to have in your closet. But here is just the completing look. Just added this brown coat and then like my beige accessories. So if you have a tan coat like this, you're golden. You can pretty much use it with anything. So I'll link a couple of these for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check the description box because that's where you'll find all the links to everything I showed you guys in this video. And make sure to hurry and click because these will sell out for sure. Again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.